Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to do a really small um, unboxing video from the things that I got into my PO box. I'm also going to show you a few of the stamp albums that I received um, from my mother. Sorry about the background noise if you can hear trains or traffic um, as I'm quite close to the train lines now after the move. Um, but as I was saying, I've got stamp albums that I brought back home from my mother's place. They sold the house um, up in Lennox Head, so I had to clear my room and I found some really cool things inside. So I thought I'd go through those. Yeah, let's get started. <laughs> so this postcard here was from Pen Paling Paula. You can see her Instagram. I really, really love this postcard. It's absolutely beautiful. I think this is actually her own design. I'm not 100% sure, but she's got lots of beautiful postcards on her Instagram. So if you're not already following her, go check her out. This next one is from Margaret from Poland. Alrighty, so let's jump into opening this one. She's got really beautiful washi tape at the bottom here. Sorry, I'll just pop everything that I really love straight into this little journal here. This is the journal I got out of the Sahai box, I'm pretty sure it was called. That box that I did a review on my channel. How pretty is that? Ooh, I love it. Um, if you're watching this, let me know where you got your washi tape from. Okay, let's see what's inside. Oh, this is beautiful. This one says goodies, and I really like the twine too. So she's made a little pocket. Okay, so we've got some pretty paper. This one says for a mermaid and then it says beach mail. Oh, and it says see you on the back, like S-E-A. What is this? Oh, beautiful. So there's just little goodies inside and some memo pads. Very, very cute. Some pretty paper. Oops, there's a image there. I don't know if she'd want me to show that. Oh no, I think that might be a generic image. Lots of pretty stuff inside. Thank you so much. All right, let's open this one. I don't know if you guys like this background. I don't know if it's too hard to see the mail because um, my camera's really bad at focusing in and out. But if you wanted to know where this sunflower tea towel is from, it's from H&M and it's from the homeware section. This is so cute, I love this wrapping. I really don't want to ruin it, but we've got to open it. Oh, I'm going to rip this. Oh, how pretty is on the front? Okay, I'm going to cut it at the top so I don't have to rip anything. It's like a little mini mail. Do you, do you guys watch my mini mail series where all the mail was like that size? <laughs> um. Ooh, some more goodies. So we've got memo pads really cute we've got some beautiful tea oh even more cute things inside i think those are going to be stickers some little this looks like oh she's got her address inside there so i won't open it <laughs> um oh a little letter on that side i won't open that i love this washi tape it's so pretty and that's everything inside. Well, thank you so much for that. I can't wait to read your letter and um, go through all the goodies again. So this beautiful letter was from Mike from the Netherlands. I'm not gonna open it up. I just wanted to show it on camera. So if you're watching this, you know that I received it safely. So this lovely letter is from India and it's from a lovely lady called Sanini. I hope I'm pronouncing that right. Uh, but let's open it up, it's actually quite heavy. So inside the white envelope was this adorable envelope. I absolutely love this little Totoro here. And if you flip it over, let me just see if I can get this in focus for you. It's a little dog and it's got someone chubbing, chubbing his cheeks, I was gonna say, like squishing his cheeks um, and squishing his little ears. So I'm actually gonna take that one off and just pop that one in. My little journal here, cause I really wanna keep that. It is adorable. Let me see if I can do a close up. Alrighty, so let's see what's inside. Oh, lots of stuff. I really like this design on the front. So there's a whole book, a notebook inside. Alright, so we've got the beautiful letter here, which I can see already. It's 
the most beautiful handwriting. I love beautiful handwriting because I really suck um, at writing really neatly. I have the worst handwriting ever, so if you ever receive a letter from me, I'm sorry my handwriting is not the best. <gasps> but let's just focus on this postcard right here because as you all know, I am obsessed with um, Studio Ghibli and this is just adorable. I really wanna make a wall um, above my bed or somewhere in this new apartment of just beautiful postcards and things that you guys send me, but this is definitely going straight into my journal. So thank you so much. Here is a little close up in case you didn't see it properly. I love it, thank you. So we've got also another postcard here um, with all these thongs that um, it looks like I should color in. And this beautiful note pad or notebook here and inside is this really pretty collage i really really like your collaging style it's quite similar to my own and then we've got this little goodie bag here so a little totoro more little totoro stickers yay <laughs> that makes me happy little succulents and some beautiful washi tape and this one here is a Totoro one. Here's a close-up of the Totoro washi tape. It looks really cute with the two little Totoros. This one's so adorable. All right, well, thanks again for sending me all these goodies. Um, I can't wait to start using them and I can't wait to read your letter, so thank you. Alrighty, so lucky last is this beautiful one from Turkey. Um, I'm so sorry, I, I tried to pronounce your names a few times, but I didn't get it right, but um, you'll know who you are. Firstly, what I wanted to do was, again, save some of this washi tape, because I always say that I'm gonna save the washi tape that I love, and then, I pack everything away and then I never do. So I thought it'd be really good to have this little journal next to me to start saving all the things that I love. So I'll pop that one aside and let's open this little package up. I'm really loving all the collaging that everyone's doing. Oh my goodness, 4B10K, oh, thank you so much. You can see it's been a little while since I made this video because I've now got 17,000 subscribers, but that's so sweet of you um, to send me something for hitting 10K. I really appreciate that. Open me. So this one's actually made out of a paper bag, I can see. Oh, this is so cute. <laughs> All right, first thing I see is this beautiful little heart here. Oops, I really wanna, I don't wanna whip this, it's so adorable. Oh, we've got a little shaker pocket, I love that. And some beautiful twine inside, it's adorable. Oh, we've got something in here. Oh, postcards, did I get all that? Yep. Okay, so we've got some beautiful postcards. Oh, there's some writing on the back as well. Thank you so much for those. And then this is beautifully decorated. Does this come off? Oh, that's really cool, it's a magnet. Oh, I love that. Very beautiful pocket as well. And then I'm guessing this one, oh, no, I ripped it. Oh, I thought this was gonna be let up, but it's more goodies. So we've got gifts. Let me see if I can pour out the gifts. Oh, that's beautiful. Oh, I love that. Let me do a little close up. Can you guys see that? It's Winnie the Pooh and it's a little um, pin. I mean, a badge. Very, very cute. And then we've got some more goodies. And then, oops, this one is the letter and it's in a little book form. And she's made it herself. Thank you so much. This is so cute. I love your little ideas, the shaker pocket. And this is really beautifully made too. All right, well, that was the last one. So what I'll do now is I'll go grab the stamp albums and we'll go through those as well. All righty, so I said the second half of this video was going to be the stamp collections um, that one of my relatives um, collected. And I thought I'll do a quick flip through of this one because I thought it was really cool for you guys to see the stamps that were in this collection. Um, and I admire people who stamp collect.
I've never been known for my cautious side. You should know that I'm well aware. I don't want anything left untried. Will you come with me, Mom? So let us just do my love and not stop. going to be a lot easier to see if I put it on the white background. So as I said there was a few things collected within the box that weren't just stamps. There was a few, I don't know what this was, it was to get a free tasty burger and dog, so a burger and a hot dog, which I thought was so random. So I just want to keep those little things as well, but these were my favourite stamps. We've got this little nine cent crab here, the little hermit crab. We've got this beautiful, um, the flowers. I really like this stamp here. I've seen this one a few times and I really like the color of this one. And again, it's next to the little crab. I thought this little cat was adorable. Um, and it's so funny to see the senses on them. So nine cents, 43 cents. This one here again, um, National Stamp Week. 1980s, which I love this one so much and I just thought this colour was adorable. So what I'm gonna do is I thought I'd pop them in my little book. So that's what I'll be doing this afternoon. Um, but I hope you enjoyed this video today. I hope you got some good ideas from the um, snail mail that I got in the my pair box. I hope you enjoyed watching me open them and I'll be using a lot of my new stamps from the stamp collection in a lot of my um, future videos. So um, thanks again for watching and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!